Here's a really quick video lesson on how to play our arrangement of Bad Blood by Taylor Swift. Um, this whole song is kind of in a feeling of two. So throughout the song, if you notice on the arrangement here, um, it is going to, there's going to be two chords that you're going to play. Um, so we don't just give you space until you play the next chord. We actually give you where you're going to play that chord, whether it's on a word or the syllable or not a word, if there's a rest in there. Um, and this song is kind of what I call a repetitive song in terms of chords. So once you learn the chord progression, the order of the chords, then it's the same thing. So here in Bad Blood, we've got C, G, D, and then E minor. So what I would do first is practice those chords in order, just playing them once. I'm gonna play them here on my half-size Kahala guitar, uh, acoustic guitar here. So we're gonna have C, and then G, and then D, and then E minor. And then practice that until you become comfortable playing it. So like I said, this song is in a feeling of two. Um, that means you'll play each chord twice. So once you get comfortable playing the chord progression, add another strum or add another another um, beat of that chord in there. So for example, here I'm gonna play two C's, and then two G's, and then two D's, and then two E minors. And then we'll repeat that. Here are my D's, and then E minors. So it's nearly like that throughout the whole song. Uh, with a couple exceptions uh, in the pre-chorus, at the ending, um, and then I think maybe in the bridge a little bit. When you do get to the bridge, by the way, um, that is, um, there's a part where it's just one strum per chord. Uh, so, um, I, so I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate how the chorus goes, um, and I do want to let you know that this is for educational purposes only, not intended for performance. Uh, this is just to kind of teach you how it goes. So if you notice in the song, uh, if you're taking a look at it, the first chord you strum on is on the word now. So that means you're going to say, because baby, before you start strumming, if you want. Uh, if you want to add in like an E minor, because baby, now we got bad blood, you could do that. The, the E minor would come first. So I'm going to start right on my C chord here. Uh, and here is the chorus. Cause baby, now we got bad blood. You know we used to be mad love. So take a look what you've done. Cause baby, now we got bad blood. Hey, now we got problems. And I don't think we can solve them. You made a really deep cut. And baby, now we got bad blood. Hey! And then we'd get into the first verse there. So, uh, pardon my mistake there in the middle when I got um, kind of jumbled up with my fingers there. Um, but you'll do a lot better when you practice that. So that's just a little sampling and a little teaching of bad blood there. Uh, be sure to pick up your copy uh, soon on Sheet Music Plus, uh, where that is sold exclusively on there. Um, and let us know if you have any comments or any questions on the song. And we'd be happy to talk to you about that. Happy playing, everyone.